Same with a cane, whether it's used for balance or an injury. Only if it's used for balance can you put it in either hand. But when it's an injury, you walk with the cane in the opposite hand of the affected leg. Therefore, if you're walking with the cane, it's the cane with the affected leg first, and then with the back leg, you just push forward and walk. Choosing the appropriate cane is important. You can go with a single tip, and this is used for just balance. But if you have to bear your weight, maybe due to an injury, you use the four tip. Now, choosing the grip is very important. They make a general plastic grip, and that is just for the basic standard use. And then they also use a foam grip. Now, the foam grip is used for comfort and will also release pain in joints and such diseases like arthritis. Now, fitting the cane is not hard. You just want to make sure you have a 15 degree bend in your arm and make sure that the cane aligns with your wrist. While walking upstairs, you just use the affected leg, which is the injured leg, and with the cane at the same time, step up and push off the back. You have to find one that's best fit for you. There are three kinds. One's without wheels, one's with two wheels, and one's with four wheels. If you're bearing weight, then you don't want to use the one with four wheels, otherwise you can slip. If you're just using it for balance, those could be faster to get around. Um, when selecting the grip, you want to make sure it's comfortable, that you can hold on to it. People with arthritis might want bigger grips. Um, people without it may feel more comfortable with just a simple plastic grip. When using a walker, you have to make sure it fits right. To know whether it's big enough for you, it must line up with the crease of your wrist. Now, to walk with it, you want to bring the walker out in front of you without bending or leaning on it. Then you take a step in, and then another step in. You never want to cross this threshold. Stairs with a walker. Instead, use the elevator. 